Hey everybody. Uh, what I'm going to be working on today is a cushion for the bow of my boat and it will serve two purposes. It's going to be a cushion for my wife to lay out in the sun and just for anybody riding on the bow. Uh, and my daughter, she's only nine years old, so she's pretty short. So uh, it's also going to serve as a cushion for her to sleep on. I had a hard time finding the kind of foam that I wanted. And when I did find it, it was uh, really expensive. So what I picked up, and I've already cut this. I've already cut this out. I laid it on the on the bow of the boat and cut it out. But this is carpet padding. It's probably about a half inch thick. And I bought enough to layer it. This enough to do three layers. I think was around twenty bucks. It wasn't that much. And. Uh, this is the uh, the glue I'm going to be using to glue this stuff together. Uh, fabric fix. Uh, it says it's safe to use on most foams. It was ten dollars at Hobby Lobby. And then material I'm going to do. I'm going to be sewing for the first time. My mom gave me a sewing machine, so I bought this material. I'm going to do one side of the pad. I'm gonna do one side in this, it's these anchors. And then the other side, I've already cut. I've already cut a piece. Let me set this camera up here. I've already cut the other piece to the size that I need it to be. But it's also a kind of a nautical theme. It's, uh, it's got sailboats and uh, like a world map on it. I don't know if you see that there in the video, but anyway, so one side is going to be this and then the, the other side is going to be just anchors. That's the plan. I got two pieces now, so I'm at an inch thick, and I'm gonna do one more, which will give me an inch and a half. So now all I have to do is glue all three of these pieces together. Go through that hole first. You just have to go down through that. And then down. And then which direction does it go through the It came out of that. That thing's open on the back. It came right out of it. It should have a straight back. So that should be that I think. Yeah. But I did it wrong right there. All you gotta do is go back there, I think. Because it came from back there anyway. But it came out from back north there. Yeah. This why you need tweezers in it. Mm -hmm. And then it should. I gotta turn it on. There we go. It should. So. I'm just gonna do half of this length here. Uh oh. It didn't work. What did I do wrong? Uh oh. Doing something wrong. I can't figure out what I'm doing wrong. 
There it goes. Heck yeah, there we go. Alright, I'm just gonna start going and as the pin gets to the foot, I'm gonna just pull it out. And just keep going. Worked out real well. That's that side. Flip it over to that side. Like I said, this is going to be for the bow. Uh, this would be the end close to the windshield. And this would go towards the bow. And then my hatch window, I've got a... It's cut out there and I'm going to trim that out. Sew it accordingly. The pillow that I made, or that I'm making, will go, let me get this way up here. The pillow is gonna be the width, the same width, width as the, uh, that, so the pillow will lay on my windshield up here like this. I almost make like a lounger uh when we're at anchor so i'm happy with it action the first mate putting the new bow pad into action <laughs> <laughs> 